spot it though. And another Tamiya's notebook. <laughs> yeah, now our spells are pretty cheap. Pretty cheap. <laughs> I've said it before and I'll say it again. Don't you let your memes be dreams. If you want double notebook, go and get it. <laughs> it's very easy, of course. Here's how we do it. If you haven't seen this card, by the way, it's a new card from Kamigawa Neon Dynasty. It has completed where you can uh, pay the green part there with either green, blue, or two life. I've never ever used the completed on this thing, but it has it, so that's cool, I guess. You get plus one. Tap up to one target artifact or creature. It doesn't untap during its controller's next untap step. Yeah, pretty decent. You can minus X, exile target non land permanent card with a mana value X from your graveyard. Create a token that's a copy of that card. Oh, we're starting to see the theme here, okay? We're creating tokens that are copies of things, okay? And then minus seven, create Tammy's Notebook, a legendary colorless artifact with special cost to cost two less to cost, and draw a card. It's a pretty, it's pretty good notebook. It's a pretty good notebook. <laughs> so, of course, you want more than one notebook. How do you get one more than one? You put down mirror box, you remove the legendary rule, then you put down Essica's chariot and you attack in with it, and whenever it attacks in, it can create a copy of target token you control. It can be any token, it can be creature tokens, and it can even be the Tamiya's notebook. Amazing! Of course, there's another, there's another combo here. You can also go Tamiya minus X, return anything, like for instance the Welcome Vampire from your graveyard, and then attack in with Essica's chariot, and then you create another token that's a copy of the Welcome Vampire, which is then going to draw your card from the first Valkyrie Vampire and then everything's gonna draw more cards and more cards and more cards and more cards and more cards. And that's pretty much the theme behind the deck. Since we have In Search of Greatness, we want to draw into... We want to have as many 4-drops, or at least one 4-drop, on the battlefield, and then use In Search of Greatness to just get something down for 5 every turn. Because Tamiyo has a tendency to either die or you minus X to remove it, and Morit just copies something that is already on the battlefield, so... It doesn't have mana cost 5, so you can always activate the In Search of Greatness. If you haven't seen this card, by the way, at the beginning of upkeep, you may cast a permanent spell from your hand with mana value equal to 1 plus the highest mana value among other permanents you control, without paying its mana cost if you don't scry 1. So it's also a great way to go digging for our 1 of mirror box. <laughs> we have Wedding Announcement, works insanely well with Welcome Vampire, and of course one of the best plays with In Search of Greatness is go this turn 2, turn 3 Welcome Vampire, Turn 4, you get Toski for free, and you draw double cards. It's just good. And then you have a lot of mana to just play anything else for. Spirit of Companion fits perfectly into the deck. It draws a card, it triggers Welcome Vampire. We just want to dig through the deck, dig through the deck, dig through the deck. I mean, that's pretty much it. Let's jump into the games. We have the card, everybody. In Search of Greatness. I've been smack talking this card for a long while, saying it's not good, and it's probably still not good. But well, we have to try it. I think that this is the perfect opportunity to try it. Now we really have nice combos with it. Hopefully initiate. Okay, training. Oh, that's final. Putting down the In Search of Greatness. And if it doesn't kill the Welcome Vampire, I think we gotta get really... Mwah, mwah. That happens. Because then we're gonna... Welcome Vampire, so we're gonna draw one from Toski, and then Welcome Vampire is gonna attack in, and we're gonna draw another card. Oh, so many cards! <laughs> Shane, absolutely insane. Okay, now we just need Lancer. Lange. Now, well, well, aren't you happy that you found the combo card? You say? Uh, yeah, yeah, I'm very happy. I'm happy I found the combo card. That, that's what I am. No, don't you dare kill my Velcro Vampire! I would have set up everything perfectly. Here. What random removal spell are you gonna have? No, oh no, 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 yes! Perfect! Perfect leather armor! Uh -huh. That's only hopeful initiate. Oh my god, that guy's huge! How are we ever gonna deal with that thing, okay? I guess the thing is we don't deal with it, and we just. BADOOSH! <gasps> oh, that's good, okay. That's really good. Uh, can we? We can't even do a double play with this, but we can do another welcoming vampire, and that is kind of cool. And then we do. Are we gonna lose this though? That's question. Oh my god, they, they have blockers though, unfortunately. But they don't block, so it doesn't matter. Okay, perfect. <laughs> they have blockers, but they they're simply not using them. Okay. 
And remove two plus counters on the creatures. Destroy target artifact or enchantment. Ooh. Oh, they don't want that <laughs> to ever happen. Okay. Mm, Monk of the open hand. Man, everything is getting buffed. In every possible way. Okay, hopefully initiate. That needs to be... Oh, oh my god, it removes... Okay, the Claren Spirit. Claren Spirit attacks in. Okay. One thing, but then it just dies. Okay. What is going on? <laughs> okay. Alakaz block you. I guess. And we'll take three. It's so simple as this, you take three, not, not, that's not a problem. Tamio, easiest Tamio ever, I say. So we want this now to be locked down. Unfortunately, this has ward. You can also lock down this so it doesn't ever untap. We don't have anything to return from our graveyard anyways, right? So, yeah. We tap something and it doesn't untap. Which one is gonna be, though? Training? When this creature attacks with another creature with power greater than... Greater power, put a plus count on this creature. Uh, I mean, it's a little bit scary, this thing, and it does have nature's presence. Uh, let's see here. And then it's a bad feeling, you get a, you, Okay, it gets plus one, plus one. And you get a spin. Oh, that's all it does, okay. Maybe the floor blows, guys. We'll hold him down. And then we'll do this. Just gotta double trigger the draw. <laughs> Did we go overboard with the draw, though? Is it too much draw? No, no. No, 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 no. Oh, wait, wait, wait. We're not gonna crew now. What am I doing? What am I doing? Okay. But we do want to attack in, though. I'll do a conservative... Uh, Two things attacking, because we're, uh, we're still at 12, so... Need to be a little bit careful there. Okay. Good! I'm so happy he didn't have a removal spell. So, so happy, okay? And Tarno. Have a couple of blockers here for his army. Great companion, that's a good one. Good one, buddy, gotta say. Plus counter on... Something. Clarion Spirit is, uh... It's dangerous. Place a second spell there. That's another 1-1 one, one white spirit. But he doesn't have another! Okay. Goes in with both. Okay. Training. Uh, cool. In that case... Actually, we don't want to block with a welcoming vampire anyway, so we go with this. I'm a little bit afraid he's gonna kill this thing. A little bit afraid. We're gonna do this, and hope that it doesn't have a buff. Ooh, it does have a buff, okay. Let's get him. Let's get him with that. That's just fine, not a problem, okay. What was that there? Unfortunately, our Seeker Sierra is not doing that much yet, but we are soon gonna create Tamio's notebook, and then we'll be able to continue our naughty nonsense here. Okay, that thing has Ward 1. So that thing is not getting tapped down. I guess we don't want this to be trading. Right? So this is gonna double draw. A uh, triple draw, I mean. <laughs> Way too many cards. Okay. And then. You just randomly put down an in search of in search of greatness. Because we kind of want this for next turn, right? So, put down this. And then we could just tap this. Tap this. Do we tap our Toski? We tap our Toski, because he's not going in for much anyways. I think that's the way. I think that's the way of doing things. We go in with only this, I think, actually. We keep back our vampires. Create a dude. And maybe I should have just played the dog, though, to be on the defense, because he probably sees this uh, Tamiyo ultimate coming here. <laughs> when I think about it, when I think about it, it might have messed up here a little bit. Not a little bit, but not that. If it goes in with everything, though, I think that might be not good for him, maybe. Okay, we'll play second spell, though. Is he gonna play a second spell? Okay. Last counter. And... Faithful absence! No, that's not good. That's not good. That's not good. Okay. 
Welcome back, bar is gone. But we do have a clue to what happened. What happened to that poor lady? Okay. Is he gonna go in? He needs to go in for Tamio. Else is a notebook coming. I don't think he wants a notebook to be having here. We could actually let it die if we want to. Because we get another for free on our turn. But, ah. Uh, yeah. Okay, that thing goes in. Only that thing. Okay, sure. Block with you. And that's it, okay? Well, we're getting a notebook, everybody! Oh! Tabby, yes! Notebook! Tabby, yes! Notebook! Um, yeah, I do like that card. I do like it a lot, we'll keep that. Badoosh, minus seven. Notebook. Oh, my spell cost two less to cast, you say? Okay, I mean, that's that's kind of decent. <laughs> Play you then, I guess. Uh, how to pay the mana cost? Uh, sh sure, sure, but we'll pay it like this. And what do we have in a graveyard? We don't have anything really that we need. We are gonna play, let's see here. We are gonna play one Spirited Companion though. Now. So that we draw cards. And then... Probably tap down this guy. He's not doing anything. Keep up the Wandering Emperor, right? And let's see here. This can also draw another card. Ah, we don't want to use this now. Uh, escape, thank you. Um, Tosk is not getting in for anything anyway, so... Might as well do this. Ah, four, yeah, yeah. Uh, four, you say? Yes, exactly, exactly, exactly. I uh, will do this. Go in with the Isika Chariot. Only. And, oh, Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, uh, hmm. We can't do it though because it's legendary. I realize that now, but <laughs> we have the thing which takes away legendary. We can create multiple Tamiya's notebook if we find that. It's somewhere in the deck. It's somewhere in the deck, along with all our wedding announcements. <laughs> all four of them. Okay, we're gonna end the turn. I'm feeling kind of good about this. I feel like we have a good chance at this. Okay, that thing is gonna grow though. Okay. He wants to. Grow everything, he can do it. And he does. That's a good, that's a good call there, buddy. A good call. Plural Blows Monk coming in with the spirit, surely. And... Going for Tamiya though. <laughs> I didn't like that notebook. It'll like it one bit. Well, there's the thing, though. There's the thing. I'm fine with him killing it. Or am I? We're gonna exile the monk, right? Moloink. And then... Uh, let's see here. Do we kill the clarion spirit? And take four on our girl here? Or here's what we do. We block you. We take... Would be nice to block main. Main, okay. We'll take two of it. That's fine. Badoosh, badoosh, badoosh. Hammer down to four. Do we draw an extra card? I think so. I think so. Because if you find a thing which takes away legendary here. Oh my god. <laughs> that's gonna be insane. Come on, draw a card. I wasn't that good. That's fine. My turn. Okay. No, no, not with another Tamio. Don't, we, we know exactly what we want at this point. Come on! Ah, it wasn't that card. It wasn't that card, huh? It wasn't that card. Wasn't even that kind of card. Hmm? Well, we can return on the Welcoming Vampire. That will probably make it kind of likely. To, oh, by the way, if we do... Why? I should have done this last turn. Because now we can actually create a copy of the Vampire. I think we play this. We get more draws. Come on, I find it! Ah, it's somewhere in the deck! How can we not find it? How can we not find it at this point? Um, do we create another samurai or do we put a plus counter on something? I think we put a plus counter on. Let's see here. 
Har du på det plask, Andron? Toski? Or... Nah... Yeah. We'll put it on this. Screw it! <laughs> too much thinking, I'm sorry, opponent. It's just way too much thinking here. On the side of the board. Wait, wait, maybe we can draw it with this, though. Come on, is it? No. Wasn't that card. Wasn't that card either. Okay, sure, that's fine. I'm gonna keep this one. And... I'm gonna crew here. No thanks. Go in for big damage. Win with you. Win. Oh yeah, we have to attack with these things. Yeah, yeah, I forgot about that. And maybe attacking with this, we're gonna get another vampire anyway. Or yeah, another welcoming vampire. And we have enough lockers here on the ground, I feel like. Yep. Badoosh. More welcoming vampires. Nice. <laughs> we don't have the hopeful initiate. Uh... <clears throat> Tap down though. That's a little bit scary actually. Okay. There it is! There it is! Ah, oh, mirror box was too late though. I think. Okay, well, we have the mirror box. We have to play it now. Unfortunately, it's probably just gonna kill it. Oh no! Oh no, I want the cop of the. Oh, I want the cop of the Tavius notebook. <laughs> I don't know if that's how we win. I don't know if it's the best thing to do. But man, I know I want to copy Tamir's notebook. <laughs> it's just so... such a nice thing to do. Such a nice thing to do. Okay? Luminarch veteran. Man, this turned out to be a great game. <laughs> it's perfect. It's just clogging the board so we don't win immediately. Just a lot of dudes everywhere. Ah, oh, it's perfect. Okay, plus card on something. Tavern Spirit, sure. It's coming in for a little damage. This guy is coming in, and that guy, and that guy, okay, sure. So now we actually have the opportunity to kill the Clarion Spirit, that's kind of good. So we'll kill you, uh, block you, we can actually not kill it, so we'll just block with one dude, okay. Uh, nice, I mean that, that's perfect, that's all we want. It's all we ever wanted and all we ever needed. <laughs> sure, 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 sure. Last things on the board, and I mean, do we need another attack? We don't need per se another. Wait, can't copy something which is legendary? Yeah, it can. Okay, great. <laughs> okay, another emperor? I mean, we could just take it. I mean, we can have two at this point, so, anyways. That's just great. We can have more chariots also. I'm a little bit afraid of playing multiple Toskis though. I will admit that is a little bit scary. <laughs> just, a just a little bit scary, okay? Wait, 27 cards, okay. We're yes, again, we have to be careful here. Very, very careful. Okay, can we almost kill him in the air here, I feel like. Have the welcome vampire. We have this thing. Which can uh, tap something which doesn't untap. Like for instance... Like for instance this thing in the air here. We don't want that ever untapped. That's wait again. And... Uh, want another white source so we can play our business. And then... Oh no, no, no before we go into uh, attackers here. <laughs> before we go into attackers here! You go in! Surely, you go in! I mean, we, we push for maximum damage in there, don't we? Ah, it's what we do. And another Tamiya's notebook. <laughs> yeah, now our spells are pretty, che pretty cheap. <laughs> this is perfect. I love this. I'm so happy. Okay. Sure. Smackaroons. I think we could have killed them, I couldn't we? If we just went in with the guys in the air and we just played double wandering Ember. Yeah, sure, we could have. It could have, but that wouldn't have been as fun as what we're doing now. Would not have been as fun. Simply not as Oh my god. Oh my god, okay, are we gonna end the turn though? We can now also create even more notebooks if we want to, but uh, we're gonna... Man, we have a lot of landscape. Yep. Uh, this is gonna be a little bit of a surprise for him, I think. With the double Wandering Emperor comes down. Unless he kills... Oh, it... <laughs> it's just over! Uh, two lander! 
Two ladder. Two ladder. Two ladder. Two ladder. Do we keep a two ladder? Do we keep a two ladder? Keep a two ladder. What the world that could happen, you know? What the world? Do you think I'm not gonna get a third land? And uh, we're gonna lose because of it? <laughs> White land on top. Not a problem. White land on top, not a problem. White land on top, not a problem. White land on top, not a problem. White land. Oh no. It's good versus. Oh yes! Versus Toski. Very good versus Toski. We need to be careful. Ain't but bring careful. Okay. Double manas. Presses him. Man, this guy is playing great cards. I, mean, like, I love this card. Yeah, I play this card way too much. <laughs> That's why I'm playing other cards now. Because I play this card too much and uh, it's become an addiction. <laughs> Dollhouse, Professor of Symbology. Every freaking deck! <laughs> For about a month, I need to cool down. Maybe we'll go the, back to that at some point, because I love it, but for the time being, you know. <laughs> I need to do something else. Well, yeah. Okay. Special Symbology. Smacking in. No. Gas smacking in, huh? In the interest of our Tosca surviving, I think I will block, actually. <laughs> this might look weird, but... I really don't want him to have that when we have our Tosca down. Because that's gonna ruin our party, I think. It's gonna ruin our party. Do we play the Tosca now, though, or just another wedding announcement? I think we play the Tosca now. And he's just gonna be so sad that this thing went. Right? Maybe. Or he's not. He's, he's not even gonna care. Because he has another. And he's gonna eat. He's gonna play it and sacrifice it. Kill Tosca immediately. And I'm gonna be like... Aah. Okay, no. Edgar. Edgar, Edgar, Ed... They always have more, don't they? They always have more. Uh, but the mirror box will uh, save him, actually. <laughs> it won't die. Oh, no, it won't. Ah, it will, it will, it will. It will. You can't die that now to that, so that's great. <laughs> Can I actually go in the boat? Huh? Yep, yep, yep. That's how we do things. Psycho Cat. Ah! Toski plus one plus one! What what the gun do now? What the gun do? Okay. I mean, that's uh, a good play still. But he's still not killing the Toski, and that's what I'm so happy about, okay? Does this have lifelink? No? Good. Good, 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 good. Good, 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 good. Now then we can play uh, Tamio also. Tapping down his head guard. No! <laughs> Did you create a deck just to beat our deck? Hmm. <laughs> if this was any of my friends, I would say that. <laughs> no joke, I would say that. I would be like, you just created this deck just to beat my deck. My deck. <laughs> uh, yeah, and there would be like typical Christophs. Okay, sure. <laughs> <laughs> and that's why I play online, everybody. That's why I play online. Now we know. Okay. Uh, we don't have anything in Grey, but he's just exiling everything. Which is boring. Okay. He's gonna eat up his Edgar. He could. Oh. No. Hopefully, he's not gonna eat up this also. He's probably has another man in the But this is monocolor permanent. Doesn't work against Tamio. So, if that's his way of dealing with Tamio, it's not gonna work, actually. Which I'm very happy about. Very, very, very happy about But leave it alone! Can I have the same amount of cards as him, actually? And his Edgar is just sitting there. Luff, luff. Okay. More spiders. I need more spiders. I need more spiders with my spider, in my spider, on my spider. Um. So, if I play this... And we play a wedding announcement, right? We could also actually play the Morit. Copying our Tamio, but nah, we need to do this something. And now then, I think we still keep that Edgar tap down. Draw a card, noise! Noise, now he has both the Tamio and the Welcome Vampire to care about. Probably banishing versus the Tamio. Well, the Welcome Vampire goes in for almost lethal on Tamio, but this, uh, this is only almost. 
Oh, so in the Mirthless though, oh, he's also all about the Planeswalk curse. I ain't look at top cards. Savagery. Savagery, 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 I say. Okay, draw a card, lose one life. Lulf. This card I thought was kind of a poop when it came out, but because every other planeswalker has been so much. Like lately, the planeswalkers haven't been that good. In all fairness, they haven't been that good. And that makes Lulf look like a genius. Look like a freaking genius, I say. Okay. Hum. Awkward spot when I only have two creatures, eh? Uh, so we could kill one of the spiders. Probably best to start working on these guys, I think. And uh, Pamigo does, goes down to one, unless he has another buff spell. Good, potentially have. Okay. Vanishing worse, no? No! Good. Good, good, good. Kill stat, dude. That is fine. Pamir goes down. Puts a loyal counter there. Can we now? We can now kill Lothalith with our welcome vampire, which is nice. And then we can kind of clog the board here, can't we? With the Asikas Chariot, plus uh, another wedding announcement. We'll play this first. Asikas Chariot. A badoosh. Double cat. Oh yeah, that doesn't uh, actually do anything for us. <laughs> I realized that now. But it's fine. It's fine. It doesn't do anything. Of course, they are buffed, of course, by the wedding announcement. Uh, not a problem, though. Not a problem. Okay. Tamil. That Edgar is gonna sit still, hopefully. For a while. While we smack in with our welcoming vampire. Unfortunately, Tamil is going to fall. No? No? Because we got a token from our, our thing here. So we kill the Lothluth. The Lothluth! Going to fall. And then we're gonna draw a card from our wedding announcement also, which is nice. Oh, we have two weddings. Oh, we can only draw one. Deadly Dispute eats up Markov. Okay, that makes it get one loyalty counter. Okay. And it's not enough to save it, but... Uh... Might as well do it. Might as well do it in response, as I always say. Might as well do it in response. Okay. Ooh, Tosca, though. Oh, okay. A builder's on the ground. Psycho Cat's heating up here. It's gonna do another Soren board wipe. I'm probably not a board wipe. Probably not, I think. Probably not. Something else. Something spicy. Like a plains. <laughs> Something dangerous like a plains. Okay. Will he realize that I have no basic? I'm not gonna hover over his field of ruin, because that's gonna give him ideas. Oh, actually, I have one basic, but it's in play. <laughs> Don't use your field of ruin, sir. Don't use your field of ruin. Uh, okay, I think it's gonna choose enchantments. Oh, yeah, no, it exiles everything. Choose one or more. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay, yeah, I mean, that's, uh, that's fine and all. You can exile everything, yeah. Okay, but well, pretty good. I didn't realize how good this card was. I thought it was choose one. I was like, eh, it's pretty good. Exile all creatures, exile all artifacts. You can choose one or more. Oh, farewell is, uh, is truly farewell, isn't it? Uh, well, do this then. And, uh, plus you. And the submit we're not gonna tap down, I don't think that doesn't make any sense. No, 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 no. Okay. Have a board. Oh, if it has another farewell. Can't you exile planeswalkers with this? Oh, you can't. Oh, you can't. That's why he only has planeswalkers. Because it can't exile planeswalkers. It doesn't exile planeswalkers. Okay. Man, farewell only planeswalkers. Five color deck. Play farewell. Play only planeswalkers. Is it just me or is that... Probably gonna be good. And that's why everything exiles his deck also, because he has this exile theme. So everything exiles. That's what I think. Could be wrong though. Uh, we have exactly 13 HP. Soren the Mirthless is on minus 7. Oh! <laughs> We're gonna die to Soren! This is the first time I die to Soren Ultimate. This is the first time I see Soren Ultimate, to be fair. Wow, I mean, this is a good deck though. Good idea, I gotta say. You only play Planeswalkers, and then you have Farewell. 
Uh, it doesn't, though. We can play some creatures, but... We, at some point, we're gonna do a deck with Farewell and Only Planeswalkers. It's gonna be amazing. <laughs> uh, can we do anything to survive? Can we gain one life point? Could we, theoretically, in any way, gain one life point? I think, theoretically, we could, right? If we return our dog a doggo <laughs> Our dog a doggo We draw a card, and we completely miss on that, but that's fine. Because we have Morit, right? And we play Morit. No, we can't copy his things. We can create another Tamiyo. Which can't do anything, because he's exiled everything, but we can uh, do Spirit of Companion, of course. Hit another land. Hit another land, it's fine. It's fine. We might just lose the Soren Ultimator. Just saying. <laughs> that farewell. That farewell? Oh, that was good, also. But wait. Wait, sir, you play Path of Parent, Farewell, and Doomscar. I love you, sir. <laughs> This is exactly what I wanted to do. He got us. Thank you, everybody, so much for watching. And a special thank you, of course, to the latest members of Join. And they are Kingsley, Jason A. Faini, Lodad, Jack, and Bo Booty Sweat. <laughs> also, welcome back, Peter Gohl, Uberfish, Simon Lauer, John Silver, and Bill Murray. See you, everybody, tomorrow! Hello, Daniel! And you are? It's -a me, the YouTube algorithm! And. Well, what are you doing here? I'm just here to take those views! No, the. Those are my views! Oh, I can explain to you, Senor. You see, you have subs 0%. And non subs, a hundred percent. That's why you can take all your views. <laughs> I guess it's time that you uh, check out a little, little thing down there.